I've heard tell of a story that's probably not true of a lady who goes to a jewelry store and asks if they have any crosses that she'd like to buy. And the lady behind the counter, who apparently has no idea what's going on, says, would you like one with the little man on it or without? You know, there's just a tendency, I think, for us to become so accustomed to the idea of the passion, to the crucifixion of Jesus Christ, to the image of the cross, that it can be just kind of like a wallpaper in our life. An interesting decorative taste, whether you have a cross with the little man on it or without. But it doesn't mean anything. Or, still worse, we can think of it as just maybe a historical event and nothing else that doesn't really relate to our life. Jesus gives us this incredible gift that every single year we consecrate a whole week to do nothing except remember and re-enter the life-giving drama of the Passion. The crucifixion of Jesus Christ happened at a specific moment in time in the past, yes, but it's not a past event. It's present with us now. Christ is present in that same saving love. He still stretches out his arms on the cross as an act of abandonment in love and perfection of will for us so that we can be saved, not just by something in the past, but by the love that Jesus Christ has for you right now.